Hello and welcome to Garb Studio. In this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to create this postcard mockup with leaves using Adobe Photoshop. So, without further ado, let's get started. I've already added the background image with a tropical leaves background where we are going to incorporate our mockup image. First, Unlock the background layer by clicking the small lock icon on the background layer. Then, duplicate the background layer by pressing Ctrl plus J. Select the duplicate layer, navigate to the select option in the menu bar, and choose color range. Now, use the eyedropper tool to pick the color of the canvas and adjust the fuzziness according to your preferences. Once satisfied, click OK. Now, add a layer mask by clicking on the layer mask icon located at the bottom of the layer panel. Select the layer thumbnail of the duplicated layer and choose the rectangle tool from the toolbar. Now, draw a square on the canvas to create a square canvas of the same size as the original canvas. Right click on the rectangle layer and convert it to a smart object. Again, right click on the rectangle layer and choose create clipping mask. Now, double click on the smart object thumbnail and it will open the canvas we created in a new tab. Drag and drop your postcard, art, greeting card, or whatever you have onto the canvas and adjust the size accordingly. Then click on the close icon and it will prompt a message box asking to save the changes. Click the yes button, and you will have your desired mock-up. Now proceed to the blending mode and select a blending option as per your preferences. I am choosing multiply. If you need to modify your design, Simply double click on the smart object thumbnail, and it will reopen the canvas we created in a new tab. Drag and drop your updated design, adjust the size as needed. Then click on the close icon and choose the yes option when prompted to save the changes. This way, you will have your updated and desired mock-up. Thank you for watching this tutorial. I hope you found it helpful and informative. 